Alright, how you guys been doing and welcome back to what is really just another tougher game for me. Gotta be sad. Ironhead is still quite alright versus the majority of this team. Let's see, leads off with the Grumpy. Alright, that's a Grumpy lad. So going for an Ironhead shouldn't be all that bad. He did have mods resisted the hell out of that. But yeah, Ironhead I think is safe enough. Boom shakalak! That was a crit, that was a... <laughs> Damn! Rocky helmet, please. Oh, and I get the flinch! I get all of it. I get all of it. Not that it necessarily matter. Um, Heatran is actually surprisingly effective versus me. And I don't want to get the flame body. I gotta try to kill it. My opponent should switch out. Nope, just stays in. Forces me to take more residual. Which is fair enough. <sighs> Gold ego. I mean, I'll, I'll take any hacks I get. Though, I, I, I don't know. Flinches to me are a bit on the rougher side. Like... I'm not saying I don't accept them, but I always feel so bad when that happens. So right, Mr. Moldbreaker, man. And this, 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 uh, this guy got a lot of things going for it. Um, Vasco should be able to um, to soak some of it. Unless we see, um, I was going to say Gig Evolution, but I mean uh, a Terra Evolution here. Uh, go for it. Ivy Cloche, or Kugel. I still did a lot. Still got me in fucking range though. Not the best time. Indeed not. If if I could get around this somehow. Without sacrificing the mod, that is. I gotta do it. I think I should scare him off. Maybe. Possibly. <laughs> I was like, can I do it? I should. <laughs> I really should. <laughs> Whew. Oh, the main. That's the main lad. That's the main lad indeed. Let's see. Protosynthesis is gonna boost what? Speed! Yeah, that's not great. So the only way, way for me to stop this is by, in theory, get this guy on, on, <laughs> in here. Head jolts, let's do this. Basically, if Pin Churching can survive whatever moves it decides to go for, that would be great. And basically take it from there. But if I'm not able to take it, then I am on a timer on how much damage I can actually maneuver and get out of here. I mean, Fluttermane's um, power output is insane after all. Yeah, that doesn't help. Because I like that I had like a resisted thing going, but with losing half my HP on my Iron Moth, it becomes a liability to say the least. Gonna boost my special attack before I fucking fall, eh? Here we go. Damn shame. Oh, I <laughs> actually took it. But it won't help. It won't help. How? How would it take it? I could have stayed in. Gone for a hit. That's, um. That somehow is a little bit annoying. There's no effect. And Dark Law is neutral. Can Tuscalot take a hit is the question. I mean, I got my lads here who should be able to take a few hits or not. But, in theory, I am baiting this guy to go for a Moonblast, I'm sure. So, while I do want to go for a Sword Stance, 
Um, my best option is basically go for Dark Claw, hoping to get something going. Oh, it does have speed though. It's a hard neutral hit. Damn, that did a lot. And I did nothing. I did absolutely. How does he outspeed me? It's not. It's not possible. <laughs> it's not good. It's not good. It's not good at all. If only you weren't that weak. Right. I gotta back on this then. Right, Tuscalod. Hopefully it doesn't have mystical fire, right? There's no way it switches out, so I think I can go for a solid knockoff. Shadow Ball, come on, manage, buddy. Manage. Oh! Hell yeah, baby. <laughs> Take this! <laughs> Alright, we're still somehow in this. Though, having Sneasler would have been... Would have been great. Alright, take it from here. It's not over. That flutter may really, really dent my whole team. Here is the lad. At least it's not the blood moon. There are only so many things he in theory can do, so I'm actually going to switch this guy in. It's not that I scare him, but rather... I'll make sure that whatever he got, it won't work. Biggest nope of your lifetime. At least for now. Fucking flammable, mate. Right, power whip. I think Heatran is a superior choice to switch in. Just decide to stay in, which I'll happily accept. He should have crunch or headlong rush. Nope. Not sure that kills. It did. A nasty chunk, though. I, I won't deny it. I won't deny it. No more terrain for me. I actually think I pulled this out. <laughs> Unless he crits me, I should be able to uh, keep myself somewhat afloat and let um, <laughs> let his uh, burn kill him, basically. Yeah. Half the damage. Not even once, mate. Not even once. So if I were you, I probably... No, I shouldn't. He should keep me... He should keep me afloat, for sure. There's a small part of me that wanna um, sack in Pinchurchin, but... I mean, if he gets that surprise crit, it, it, <laughs> it would have been most unfortunate. But yeah, the tumbleweed actually does stuff. How about that? Probably my more um, less creative man in this type of team. I won a spinner. I got this. It got better sets for sure. But um, I won't deny it. I'm having a good time trying to get this guy to work. So alright, we got two miles left. We got the heat run and we got this guy. Both of them being somewhat annoying. Hedge Jolt, your time is here. The greatest sacrifice I'll ever make. Maybe. <laughs> Gonna get that surge. Because Dark Pulse. Alright, Chris Nick, let's go. I'm gonna boost my speed and then I'm gonna try to boost my special attack. Because I need to keep um Basically Hydreigon is manageable at this point. It should carry flash cannon if I'm really unlucky. But at least I should be able to stomach a hit if so. Yeah, goes for a Terra. Kinda hope it's Terra Steel, because if so, I think I've still are fine, really. Poison. Ooh. 
Of all the things I expected, this was not it. Well, hopefully Calmine keeps me afloat. Surprise Gunshot? No. Let's find out. Terra Blast Poison. I swear it's still gonna hurt. It is still a Hydreigon. Boom shakalak. Alright. Oh, he withdraws! That's nasty. Good play. Good play indeed. Here comes the Psy Shock. We'll do nothing. And I'll die through Life Orb. Alright, this could get somewhat scary. Let's go Tuscalod, gonna boost that attack. Get that false sense of righteousness. I, I do recognize that he's still floating. So I guess I kinda lost if he switches out here. He doesn't though! He doesn't! Why wouldn't he? I'm still screwed though. I'm still screwed. He still has Levitate. This lad still got Levitate. Let's see. How many more turns of train do I got? Well, enough to... Sack play. <laughs> Basically my play is to go for Iron Head flinches. That's not great. You know what? More part my opponent. And I really mean that. It sucks for me, sure. But I, I wouldn't lie. I would lie if I said I didn't have a great great time. Kinda wish I missed some speed now, that's for sure. Alright, I need... You know the flinches I was talking about in the early game? I need those right now. The boost in attack, while well, sure, it will help me. But I need those 30% probably more than once. Come on, Tuscalod. Flinch, flinch, flinch. No! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking GG. That was great. Nicely done. To my random opponent, nicely done. I really mean that. Fluttermane might be pushing it, but the last plays from your side was absolutely great. Nicely done. So as always guys, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed this, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care everyone, right? Bye.